Hey there everybody. Um, this is a follow-up tutorial to my backdoor break-in tutorial I made a few years ago where instead of just running the clockwork in and pushing the button, you um, clockwork warp in. Um, this clockwork warp is very similar to the clockwork warp for snakehead skip, and so all the theory and how to do is kind of the same. Uh, just there's a few differences in how the trick, uh, you know, kind of ends up panning out. So first things first, you want to make sure your clockwork egg can go through the crack in Talon Trot because you'll be pooping a grenade and then immediately shooting a clockwork. So shoot an egg, switch to grenades, poop your grenade, have it go around, shoot your clockwork, and then there you go. Um, like Snakehead Skip, the clockwork can bounce back at you uh, or... Um, you know, can go through the crack. Um, it's kind of random. And so I feel like there really isn't any difference in where you uh, in where you stand on the door. See if these eggs are kind of coming back at me. Now, something I see happen a lot with this clockwork warp in particular is the clockwork will break on the inside of the door, meaning you need to run the clockwork inside. In a snakehead skip, it's a very short distance, but in this clockwork shot, it's actually a very long distance. So what you want to do is just shoot your clockwork as early as possible so that way when you do run in you'll have enough time to get into the door um, i think if you're positioned a little more to the right your clockwork will have a better chance of actually making through uh, without cracking but if you end up doing a fast shot and your clockwork comes through the door like and you don't uh you don't end up warping your like your your clockwork just walks in you can always just hit the button as a backup instead 